morning. Howdy, viewers, and welcome back. Brad, proprietor of our stool entertainment, doing another Red Dead Redemption 2 video. I've been exploring a whole lot more, and the guidebook has helped me out a lot, and I realized I missed a lot. This is a very, very dense, rich world. Even stranger interactions are much more interesting. And one of the things I'm doing is I'm going to do a lockbox location for a few places where you can find some money. And then I'm going to show another location on the map that I come across or came across and Arthur Morgan scribbles that location into his notebook. So let's get on with a few lockbox locations. On the northeast side of St. Denis, there's this cabin, oblong, really long cabin, and vagrants are sometimes in it, but there is a lockbox containing cash, and if you don't have it already, it's a poison arrow recipe, and you got to go, there's this area, but you got to go behind the bed in order to find it. Yeah, this one contained two billfolds with cash, which is fine because I'd already found the poison arrow recipe. Now, the next lock box is not too far from this cabin in the same area of St. Denis. It's by the horse stables, and I'm going to just cut to that one. This one is behind the stables here, and yep, yeah, here we go. You kind of got to play around to activate it. There's not a lot of good stuff in it, but if you, I mean, the snake oil, there's an apple, and there's something else, but I can't take it, Miracle Tonic, because I already have that stuff. Now, yeah, this one is out behind the stables, not too far off from the cabin. Now, I'll show you on the map, you can see where the player is, and now I'm going to move out to another lockbox, which is way out in the swamps by a railroad bridge. Yeah, for some reason my horse is really uncomfortable out here in the swamp, but this one is located right by this railroad kind of bridge, and it's a chest actually. You can see it there glowing, but you search this chest, and there's some decent stuff in it. Fine brandy, a coin sack, um, and some a billfold, and some other stuff that really raises up your money. And then the next one I'm going to go to, yeah, I'm going to cut to, because it's a long walk through the swamp, my horse won't go. You can kind of see it. It's just, it's on Copperhead Landing. And you end up going there in the main mission at some point. But I'm going to go walk toward it and make sure I have some specific armament because there's alligators out there. We're now here at Copperhead Point, the burnt out cabin. And you look at it, and if you inspect the floorboard, you'll find the, I believe it's the incendiary buckshot recipe, which, yeah, I mean, it's a useful thing. I'm not going to bother to inspect the document. I'm just going to move on to the next lockbox location, which is 
kind of interesting. Now this next locked box location is outside of Van Horn Trading area. And it's this little shack here that's overgrown with flowers and stuff. And yeah, come over and I want to take a look at this sign. And it says, Madam Mazella's house. So, yeah, it looks like it was a tiny brothel. And this woman just died waiting for customers. I can't get into the cabin, try and break in, but there's the lockbox somewhere around here. I've got to find it here. The female fertility statue. Now, actually, that is worth about 20 bucks when you sell it to the fence. And, yeah. Oi, did I just see the sign? Established uh, 1850. So, that, I think it's like 1907. So, this woman would have been like well into her 60s. So, yeah, that's interesting. The next thing I'm going to show you is location that Arthur scribbles in his journal, and it contains two artifacts, if it is, that you end up finding and collecting. And if you're trying to get to 100%, they're sort of necessary. So let's get to the next location. Now, this is the Ancient Runes. It contains a Viking axe and a Viking helmet. So, yeah, the wolf guy is actually hanging around here. You know, the one that howls, I'll do a video about him. But, yeah, Old Tomb is what it's called. And there you have it, some lockbox locations to help you get some money and stuff. 
the old tomb where you can find yourself a Viking helmet and an axe. And yeah, stuff to help you out to get to 100%. If you like this video and found it informative, hit the thumbs up icon. Feel free to leave some comments. If you like this type of video, hit the subscribe button and bell icon because I post four video game related videos a week as well as some shorts you don't want to miss out. I'm Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment. I thank you for watching. I thank you for subscribing. And most of all, thanks for stopping by.